What's up guys, my name is Zerachu and welcome back to another video. So maybe you have been wondering how to grow a gaming channel from scratch and this video will be covering how to be successful as a YouTube creator by uploading gameplay videos. It seems like more and more creators are making an appearance on the platform and I absolutely love that, that's honestly so amazing and I'm very glad that gaming channels are grinding it out on YouTube. Make sure to like the video if you enjoy content you see here uh, and perhaps subscribe if you want to see more content like this. Uh, this video represents a detailed guide on how to form a gaming channel exponentially from the ground up. Uh, I will be making similar videos like these on my channel so stay tuned. Uh, and for everyone that's getting started, I hope it turns out to be good advice. So let's get into it. The first thing I have to address uh, is that out of thousands or maybe millions of creators it's hard for you to get noticed straight off the bat. Many people upload very long videos with playing gameplay and no country but who is going to watch that? If you can't see through your own video chances are nobody could uh, and pretty much when you uh, watch a video when you uh, edit out your video and go ahead and watch it if you can't uh, stick through your own video then I'm pretty sure that uh, no one else uh, would be able to just because um, playing a uh, gameplay without any commentary commentary is boring and many channels have done far better videos than these and uh, maybe even big gaming channels and that's why they are uh, getting uh, so much more support and that's why smaller channels won't be able to su su succeed on YouTube because the bigger channels uh, have already gone in depth uh, f for many uh, gaming topics and uh, things like that but uh, being yourself by being yourself and having a strong um, connection with your audience you can get really far and your personality matters much more than your content be unique and stick out from the crowd because if you're doing what everyone else is doing your viewers won't have an incentive to watch your content as a gaming channel you may go slower uh, as gaming tends to be uh, one of the hardest genres to grow a channel in. Also many people ask about equipment. In my opinion you should start out with cheaper equipment because some people get the expensive equipment beforehand but still make rubbish videos so pretty much making videos isn't a craft or a talent you can pick up straight off. It takes determination, hard work, passion, uh, sacrifices but it will be worthwhile in the end trust me. I recommend you use uh, cheaper equipment at first and uh, master your YouTubing skills as you can still be better than someone with expensive equipment by satisfying your audience, being consistent and being unique from others. Otherwise, why would anyone uh, bother watching you when they can watch way bigger channels that can easily rack up views? Another thing is that you should uh, prioritize quality over quantity, but nowadays it seems like daily uploading is a method to fast growth, but that's all on you. Making quality videos is far better than daily uploads, uh, and also you should organize your schedule where you'll be posting at a regular basis, so pretty much you should also organize your time, and you, know, you kind of need to... Uh, get some free time for making videos because if uh, here let me just give an, an example if you are busy with school then do all of your school work first and then uh, make sure to uh, I spend like uh, two or three hours making videos because you have to leave out some time and you have to balance um, your free time and uh, your studies uh, or anything else that you may have uh, in real life because uh, as I said earlier it takes a lot of sacrifices and pretty much uh, and another example would be that if you are playing with your friends you can like uh, play with them earlier in the day so then later in the day you can upload videos or maybe uh, or I stay late at night and maybe sacrifice some sleep but make a, a quality video uh, instead and that's the point of uh, this uh, discussion uh, and the uh, and uh, or this um, 
tip just because you kind of need to sacrifice some of the important segments of um, of your activities to focus on YouTubing. Also, I do have uh, even more tips for you guys. Also, uh, many people are wondering um, how, to, how to actually gain uh, the recognition they need for a channel. Well, pretty much there are many channels out there that are super big and that will steal ideas um, from you pretty much. I'm, I'm just quoting this that they, they will be stealing your ideas just because many channels uh, actually cover a bunch of topics and there's not m much uh, and there's not much you can think up uh, think of um, to uh, do something new but there are channels that always uh, have some creativity and uh, try to improvise with new content and uh, those channels are getting uh, a far wide audience on YouTube just because they are doing what they are passionate about and uh, doing something and p putting something in the mix that nobody else is doing at the moment and you also could take advantage of the trending page because the trending page is a place where you can uh, find all of the videos that are trending at the moment and uh, you can uh, get some ideas for yourself or you can ask your audience for ideas uh, as I covered in my previous video and uh, by getting those ideas you can probably make something original out of it uh, instead of just doing what other people have done you could try to add some spice to it um, and instead of doing gameplay videos you can put commentary you can put reaction videos you can do so much more and not only that but you can do walkthroughs and you can record uh, new games that have been released also fortnite uh, if you are passionate about fortnite you uh, many people um, do videos like these like uh, setting records uh, at uh, solos duo kills and uh, that's why they are getting so popular and uh, it's not like you can't do it for if yourself all it takes is a little bit of hard work and patience because um, fame won't get you straight away you need to think about it and um, uh, and holding a youtube channel and owning it, owning it takes a lot of planning and uh, and by having a good plan you can uh, be successful on YouTube and um, and pretty much that's almost all I have for this video I hope you did enjoy I hope these are some of the tips that can help improve your channel uh, greatly and essentially it will help uh, you boost your views and subscribers but as I said, it's one of the hardest genres to grow channel in. But you, um, but you got to do what you uh, are doing best and um, and uh, show your personality in all of this because your personality is why uh, your viewers will come and watch you. And that's what happens with every YouTuber. Uh, your audi your audience wants to see you and not to just the content you are producing and also for the thumbnails make sure they are catchy to the eye and uh and that's why you'll be able to attract more views and i hope you did enjoy this video as i said you may subscribe or even leave a like if you enjoyed my content and i'll see you all in my next banger goodbye everyone, everyone.